Well, it's all for a good cause, and this year was certainly no exception. An Eastside Community Trust has raised hundreds of dollars to support the Christchurch Charity Hospital. But why is it a lot less than previous years? Jared McCulloch reports. Eight dollars going once, going twice, eight dollars. Chrissy. Chrissy. Cr Chrissy. Yes. An auction all for a good cause. The Wainoni Avonside Community Services Trust have been busy preparing for their annual fundraiser, with the money going towards the Canterbury Charity Hospital. We just think they, they're really worthy of, of um, supporting every year. They're, they're just amazing people. The theme was red and black, Canterbury colours, with the ladies enjoying a luncheon and taking part in the auction. But it's been downsized since the earthquakes, a smaller venue than what it used to be. However, Chapman says it's great for the occasion to continue on. In previous years, we've done auctions, huge weekend auctions. We've raised, to this date, we've raised over 25,500 as a group. Um, and today it won't be as, we haven't got the population here anymore. We've got the attendees, but all Avonside is gone. The event was normally held over a weekend inside the church, back before the 2011 earthquakes. All of Christchurch got behind us. It was really good. Um, people were really generous. One auction, we raised over 7500 um, One of the auctioneers from one of the firms came in and uh, ran the auction for the charity hospital for free. Um, it, was, it was buzzing. Receiving a number of different items. One time we had all these paintings donated. We got over $1,000. You know, it was just amazing. However, this year the amount of money they raised was much less. $450, but she says every dollar counts. We've lost Dave inside, but we're moving forward and we're still doing with what we can and every bit counts, even if it is only, I think last year we only raised about $700, but every bit, that counts, that counts for their, for there might be their stationery or, you know, something towards the hospital, but it's still worth doing. And the Deputy Chair of the Charity Hospital says it's a great event. It's what the Charity Hospital is all about, it's what volunteerism in New Zealand's all about. It's one part of a community who can helping another part of the community who need help. He says it's important for the medical provider, saying it helps with multiple surgeries that the public services can't offer. Many people can't get onto hospital waiting lists within the public system. Hernias, hemorrhoids, varicose veins, carpal tunnels, tubal ligations. It's just impossible. Lots of people don't have the ready cash to put out for a $3,600 cataract operation in one eye or $5,000 hernia repair. People here, elderly in particular, and young people shouldn't have to wait for their surgeries. Last year there was um, one man with a hernia off work. He had to wait two months for surgery at the public hospital. They got it done within a week and he was back at work in three. You know, I mean, it's just, it's just so valuable. But Chapman says the auction is for everyone to come along and have a good time. I won't let them pay too much for everything. So. <laughs> Even if they can't remember their bill. How much did I pay? Fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> Jared McCulloch, CDV News.